This is a single phase transformer, but when you look carefully to the low voltage side, we see three bushings here. The question is why we need three bushings at uh, the secondary side of a single phase transformer. Please join me to see the answer to this question. Uh, so hi everyone. So let's basically answer this question. Why we have at the low voltage side of the transformer three bushings? This is one bushing, a second bushing, and a third bushing. This is a schematic diagram for this type of transformer. Uh, again, you have uh, the high voltage side at the primary, and then this is the low voltage side. You will have one, two, and three uh, bushings or three terminals. And we call this type of transformer center tabbed single phase transformer. Uh, and this is very common in North America, uh, especially for residential load. So let's have a look why we need this type of transformer and why we have these three bushings. Basically, the center tab transformers from its name at the center of the secondary side, you will have one wire. So the number of turns from uh, point one, let's say to point two, is exactly equal to the number of uh, turns between point two and point three, meaning that the voltage between the line and that center tab is equal to the voltage between line two and the center tab. So basically you have two provisions for the single phase voltage. And uh, let's say the voltage here is 110 volt, then you will have here 110 volt. The question is why we need this center tab, why we don't have just a single phase transformer with the output is just 110 volt. Because between line one and line two, now you will have 220 volt. So now this single phase transformer give you the option of two voltage levels, 110 and 220 volt. And in many uh, applications in the house, you need 110 volt, but also you need also the 220 volt when you have large loads, like for example, dishwashers, like dryers, uh, like AC, those big loads, they consume a huge current, then you need to raise the voltage level to reduce the the current the current level. Uh, I have a video that describes the wiring of a typical house in North America. I will put it in the description. You can refer uh, to that. OK, now uh, let's go and see this in more closely, the single tab transformer, and let's try to uh, do some uh, sort of uh, modeling. OK, so this is basically a, a software uh, that is uh, used to model different electrical parts. And this is uh, the single phase transformer center tab. So I'm energizing the transformer from the primary at a voltage level equal to 13.8 kilovolt. So I will run the simulation here. And once I run the uh, simulation, I will go and select uh, one of the uh, uh, terminals or one of the uh, devices that can be used to do the uh, measurements. So I will have a multimeter here and I will select AC voltage. So this is looks like or mimics as if we have a real multimeter. So if you come here and measure the voltage between this point and this point and the center tab point, so you will have around 110 volt. If you go and measure the voltage between the other line and the center tab point, you have another 110 volt. Now, if you measure between the two far lines, then you will have the 220 volt. So now your transformer can provide you with these two different voltages. Now, let me just bring the oscilloscope and show you something also about these uh, voltages, that these voltages will be 180 degree phase shift from each other. So let me... Uh, connect. Now let me just disconnect my uh, multimeter and let me connect the oscilloscope. So I will measure the voltage uh, between one terminal and the, the neutral. Okay, so I will get one probe to the terminal and the other probe to the to the neutral and we'll see that the voltage here. It is basically a sinusoidal, of course, and uh, it is uh, uh, has the peak value equal to the RMS value times uh, uh, root two. Now, let me uh, get the voltage again 
for the other part of the split phase, if you may say, and you see the voltage, the red one, you see that the red phase is actually 180 degree phase shift is between these two, these two phases. So that's a small description about uh, center tapped single phase transformers, why we have three bushings and where they can be used at our houses.